Hello and welcome to Daisy. This is the map Cell, which is a new map for um, Daisy. You can get it off Daisy Commando um, if you have that. It's a medium sized map. Um, we've just spawned in, as you can see. I've got Bandit Skin because I have been playing this map quite a lot on this server. Um, and I've killed quite a bit of people. Uh, so we've just spawned in Cell, Wilmus. So Cell is the sort of main city as Cherno would be or Electro in um, that map. So hopefully we can go get geared up. It's quite easy to get geared up. As I said, it's quite a medium sized map. So yeah, that should be quite easy to gear up. There's the bridge. Um, I don't know if that's for... I don't think that's the cell bridge. Um... Well, so we need to just keep running. If we keep running, we should come up to Cell eventually. There will be two bridges into Cell. So that's really when you know that you're going into Cell. So let's keep running. This is the born bit. Right, so I think this is the bridge, not not the cell, the bridge that goes into cell. It's the village just before cell, sort of this side of the map. So I think if we keep running, we will eventually come to cell. Um, oh, what was that? That's a big noise, I think that's, uh, that was lightning. I've, there should be a village over here somewhere, so I should be able to get some gear. As you can see on this server, you spawn in with a pistol, um, a bit of food, a drink, grenade, and a bit of morphine, and a bit of morphine, and one morphine, two bandages, uh, an M9, and a hatchet, and all that good stuff. So we might as well get this removed from the tool belt, the hatchet. So if we do come across you know, anyone we can just sort of sneak up on, just smack them around the head with a hatchet, get an easy kill. But I'm going to get my M9 out at the minute, just in case I do see someone, I can pop them from distance. Now, there's zombies spawned over there, so that gives me a sort of clue that there's someone over there. But hopefully we don't get over there and get murdered straight away. That would be quite a bad start. But there shouldn't be, I shouldn't think there's someone around here that would murder me. Um, I can't really see. Let's get into these woods anyway, so we can come up and we can see anyone before they see us. So we'll run into these woods. Hopefully we don't get any attention off zombies, but we, with the hatchet we should be able to sort of pick the zombies off if they come near us. So that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Let's run through all these trees here. And we should eventually come out at a village. I believe. I think we're nearly there. There we are. Now, can we see anyone? Any aggro zombies? No. Right, so we can, we've got this. There's not very many signs of someone being here. So, hopefully, we can have a successful loot. Get all these buildings looted. Then, buildings over there. If you can see them through them trees, they're very good loot. I've found about five ghillie suits all together in them so that's sort of a good place to look if you're looking for good loot you can find some good guns in there um, so that's a good place to sort of start so we'll head over there hopefully we don't come across anyone let's get into direct communication just in case we do see someone we can tell them that we're fresh spawn and that we're friendly so there's no point in killing us if he gives us shoots me, obviously I'm going to shoot back and kill that son of a bitch so where are we 
Oh, is that aggro? No, that's not aggro. Alright, we're probably better off going around this way. I'm going to get my hatch out. Because there's quite a few zombies around here. Oh, and doors are open. There's no one in there. No. I don't think. So. Let's just see if there's anyone in here. Oh, there's a revolver. And a water bottle. A revolver is probably better than the M9. It, it takes about 5,000 blood if you shoot someone. But it's got some hell of a recoil. But that's what you have to deal with. Is a revolver. Look. Can we not open that door now? Anything in here? If I can get in the door. No, there's nothing in there. Get through that door. Um, I don't think there's nothing worth taking in there. Nothing on there. All right, I'm not going to risk going upstairs and into there. I want to move on to them houses over there. Nice and rainy. Thunder and lightning. I like it. A sarcasm. I shouldn't think there's nothing up there. If anything, it'd just be a tire or something like that. I'm gonna get my hatch out just in case we get zombie aggro. I can get rid of them quickly. Right, this is a good building actually to look in. I found some good stuff in these buildings. So if we just nip in here, might as well take that can. Oh. He's dead. Not a gun in here. What's that? It's the M19. Anything in here? Apart from that dead cell. Oh, there we go. We've got Lee Enfield. So that's good. We've got Lee Enfield. So I just want to take this hatchet back and stick that on my tool belt. So we go to gear. Just to, uh, uh, add the tool belt. Pick the Lee Enfield up. There we go. Let's get this Leanne filled out. Alright, now, there's some. Is that Leanne field mags or is that M24 CCO? Alright, there we go. We've got another Leanne field mag, so that's good. Is that another one there? Hopefully it is. There we go. So we've got three Leanne field mags now. So if we get any um, son of a gun come up to us, I think we should be able to, you know, kill him before he kills us. So, oh, let's not go out that way. Let's head to them few buildings that we saw. Just make sure I've got fresh mag in as we come up again. So if we head to these buildings over here, uh, the doors are open, so that probably means that there's someone been in there. But um, we'll have a look anyway. Hopefully there's some good stuff in there. We'll just get over here. To the sandbox. Oh, missed the door. Uh, there's a drink. Uh, some matches. Uh, matches, I need them. Need some matches if we need to make a fire. You have to harvest wood with your hatchet and then make a fire with the matches. So there's nothing in there worth taking by the looks of it. No. Let's go upstairs, that's where all the good stuff normally is. Uh, so we've got a check backpack, which is very handy. It's not the best, which is the Coyote backpack. Uh, we've got a watch. Another soda can, we might as well take that. Right, let's get this. Oh, there's Leonfield mag as well, by the looks of it. So we have four Leonfield mags, that's good. Why can't I pick up this... There we go. Um, where is it? This is annoying. Oh. Need to get the option to take a check backpack. Like, 
No, ah. I had it for a minute. There we go. So, because of the bandit skin that we've got, we can't actually see the backpack on my back. Which I guess is quite handy. Oh, there's some binoculars. They're coming good. Take binoculars. Have a look in there, because that could be a map on the floor. Um, and we could take them bandages. Take another couple of bandages, that's always good to have. No, that's a watch. So, right, so we'll move on to our next building. Hopefully there won't be a zombie waiting for me outside. No, right, so... We'll sneakily get into this building. Um, there's more Leonfield mags, but I think that'll do us. I think we've got plenty. Um, looks like there's nothing good up here. No. Another drink, but we don't really need that. Another Lee Enfield mag. Alright, so let's get down these stairs and get into the next building. Is this way. Alright, we're going to have to go out the next door on this one. So we'll go out the back door. So we don't get them zombies. Anything good up here? Uh, no, not really. Alright, let's go on to the next building. Alright, so we walk out this door. Oh, oh. There you but you got to be careful with these doors because they can break your legs. Is that it? No, that's broken. Alright, is there anything good in this one? Is that another Lee Enfield? Yeah, there's another Lee Enfield in here. And nothing else good, so... Go back out of this entrance into the last building of the set. Oh, God, what's happening there? Then having a little rave by the looks of it. I might smack these with a hatchet because the hatchet you can't hear. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go. Remove from tall bale. Drop that. Remove from tall bale. Alright, and I'll pick this the end food back up afterwards. I need to reload for some reason. It's just a little bit of a bug in the game. And then we'll pop. Somehow he got me. I don't know how he done that. A little bit of a glitchy, glitchy hit by the looks of that. So that's them zombies gone anyway. You usually don't have to worry about them zombies. Cool. That lightning's loud. Right, so we shut that door. We'll stick this back onto our tool belt. Pick up the Lee Enfield and all the four mags we've got for it. And then we can... Run back up here. There's another Lee Enfield up here. Is it Lee Enfield? Yeah. Uh, and nothing else good by the looks of it. No. There's only food there. No. It's all drink. Right, so that's quite a successful loot. Um, I think we can sort of run to sell now without the worry of being, you know, not, not geared up enough. So we've got to run to the river. Because the river's the sort of guiding me where I'm going at the minute. Um, so, that's the bridge. So, you've got to run this way. This is the way to sell, well, I think. I'm hoping. I'm hoping that's not the other way. <laughs> if it is, that's a bit embarrassing. Uh, yeah, I think this is the right way. I'll follow the road. We might 
Let's just check this actually. Let's just check this last building. Doesn't look like there's nothing in there worth getting. No. Right, so it's from this way. Let's just check that I think I oh, we are where I think yeah we are. Um so we're fine who's in. So it is east to sell, so it looks very We still haven't found a map which is quite annoying. And I think we'll leave it here for this episode. We've got sort of averagely good gear. So all is good for our journey to sell will be just finishing off the journey to sell on the next episode and hopefully we can kill some mofos so please oh 